Hey, welcome back to Lost Island. Gmo here, and today we're going to do some different tame. We're going to tame a morel tops. Not something that most people really tame anymore. Not since scorched earth. We got a 145 morel tops down here. And I'm up on the top here. Just to upset them a little bit. Because they can't get to me. Because there's several of them down there. Morel tops, if they're together in a group, they will attack. But if they're by themselves, they will run because they're fairly chicken. Just like me. And they can hit pretty hard. And that's one of the reasons why I'm sitting up here. And he's about to go nay nay. Oh, did he go nay nay? Yeah, the 145 went nay nay. And as you can see, that 50 is running away. Because now he's by himself. Now, the one thing cool about the morel tops is if you're on scorched earth or in an area that is limited on water, Boy, he's really running. <laughs> um, you bring them to water, they will sit there and continually drink until they fill up with water. Then you can bring them back to your base. And this might sound sort of gross, but you can drink water from them. Well, that's patchy. Okay, I thought it was a dillo. Now, these guys are tamed up on simple kibble. Or Miju Berries. Um, unfortunately, I didn't bring Simple Kibble with. I have Superior Kibble. But either one will work. Anything above what their preferred kibble is works fine. Let's see. Uh, oh, I got no narcotics on me. Oh, man, everything is left back at the base. Hopefully this guy won't need it. Uh, let's go down and see him. Thank God for Cinecrops. Or Sonoma Crops. Whatever you want to call them. Oh, come on. I can't access you, buddy. Okay. We'll give you some of this. Well, you're eating already? You were hungry. Oh. Running around trying to forage. What have we got here? Uh, level 20 Stego. Nope. Let's go back up now. We'll go back up to the safety of the rock. Oh, and the glare. Because this is Giga territory, even though, yeah, Giga could probably climb up this rock and ruin my day. But with everything that's down there, I think he'd rather munch on all that. But then again, wyverns are tasty. Just ask this wyvern. He has munched on many, many, many wyverns. Right there, buddy. You like munching on wyverns? Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay. Oh, what does that stay go? Oh, that's the 20. 55 Bronto. 85 Bronto. A 50 Bronto. There's no Brontos worth taming over here. Brontos are... Oh, horsies. Any unicorns? My unicorn's getting lonely. Brontos are good if you're looking for uh, a lot of berries. If you're making narcotics. Whoa, I fell off. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, he's got like one bite left. He must have really been hungry. Uh, is there a little niche I can land on? No! Oh, no fall damage. No, no, no. Actually, this area here is... F oh, good. 
Yep, I guess we did get hurt. Hey, Mr. Morel Tops. All right, stop. As you can see, he can hold 750 uh, liters, gallons, whatever you want to call it, of water. And he's got a really, really good health. Stam is eh. He's got a good health, good melee. And they do hold a lot of water. And he's got a lot of weight. So if you're over in the desert biome here, you tame up a couple of these if you're not near the water source, because the water source is full of capros. You bring these guys over, it will take them a while to drink up all that water. And that water stats do not go up. There, At least I don't think there's any way... And that, you know, that's how you can fill up your water. But I don't think there's any way you can raise that. But you can drink from them. You come up and... Uh, yeah, it would be uh, fill water from inventory. But uh, there's no way to up that. But they are, they're a necessity if you're in an area where you do not have a good water source and you need water for pretty much anything, because water, water is life. And... They are pretty tough, if which I've done it before when I was on Scorched Earth, just out of boredom, I was breeding them, and I got mutations, and the mutation was in health, so I said, hey, why not? They were killing raptors, and I couldn't believe it. It's like, okay, I got base defense. <laughs> so... I mean, I can't complain. I mean, they they were giving me water in an area where I was very limited on water. They were tough, and they can hold a lot of weight. So, but if this video was helpful in any way, please hit that like and subscribe. I can definitely use it, and I do appreciate it. And I will see you guys on next adventure in Lost Islands. Till then, bye-bye for now.